Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. I have missed you guys so much. I feel like I have been gone for like a year. I feel like I haven't talked to you guys in forever. Um, if you guys didn't watch my last video, which was like weeks ago, I mentioned that I was going to just kind of take a little bit of a break. Um, I think it was like a week or so before Christmas. And I just, there's kind of a lot going on. I was busy. It's the holidays. I don't really care for the holidays. It just kind of, they kind of make me sad. And I don't know, just, I was kind of dealing with some other stuff as well. Um, I mentioned I had like a headache for like four days straight or something in that video. So I'm still dealing with headaches, but they're not as bad. So that's, that's good. Hopefully I don't have like a brain tumor because I ain't got time for that. But I hope each and every one of you had a great holiday. If you celebrate Christmas or Hanukkah or whatever, um, I hope that you guys had a great time with your family. I hope that you guys had a great New Year's Eve and I hope that you guys were safe. It's actually January 1st as I'm filming this, so I guess New Year's Eve was last night. Um, but yeah, hopefully all of you had a great time. I've missed you all. And I think that's it. Um, I'm just going to get into today's video because I am rambling right now. It just feels like I haven't, like, obviously I haven't, like, sat down and filmed in, like, a very, very long time. So I just feel like a little out of my element here. It's kind of weird. Um, but anyway, so today's video is going to be my one year update on my nipple piercing. You guys can't see what I'm grabbing, but I'm grabbing my boobs. So there's that. Um, Alright, so let's just start with my nipple piercing Q&A video. I asked you guys to ask me questions about my nipple piercings or nipple piercings in general, that kind of thing. And you guys actually asked me a lot of questions, which I thought was really awesome. Um, and I think in that video I mentioned something about how I kind of set the healing time back on my nipple piercings or something of that nature, but I said I was going to get into more detail into in this video. So that's what I'm just going to start off with. Um, Alright, so let me explain that whole situation. It was probably around the 7th or 8th, maybe 9th month mark, I decided that I wanted just to see how mine looked with um, Circular Dorian. If you don't know, when I got mine pierced, it was straight barbells. So that means the whole in the actual piercing is straight itself. It is not curved. And with like different like a nose piercing, you can change it from, you know, a hoop to just like a straight, you know, stud, no problem. But like nipple, you know, the tissue in your nipples are much, 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 much different. Um, and so it can be trickier to change from straight jewelry to curved jewelry. But I just wanted to see if I liked it on myself, um, which I should have known better because I have seen nipple piercings with, you know, curved jewelry in it and I do not care for it. It's a personal preference. If you do have curved jewelry in yours or you want to get yours pierced and you want that kind of jewelry, that's fine. Like, it's just a personal preference, you know. Um, I re really, 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 really like the straight, you know, barbell kind of look. That's just a personal thing for myself. Um, and so, I don't know, stupidly I was like, well, I'm just going to put some in and see. Not thinking about the whole fact that the hole itself would be straight. Um, so definitely it was painful to get them in. That is for sure. Um, I was able to get them in and it was definitely uncomfortable but it was definitely painful. And honestly, like, I, as soon as I got them in, I got like all, because I just um, put in like curved barbells. Um, so like what I have in my ear, like right here, not this specific one, but just, you know, that's what it looked like. Um, that's what I put in. And almost automatically, I'm like, I do not like how this looks. It's just, like I said, it's a whole personal preference thing. And on myself, I don't care for that. I don't like how that looks. So I ought, like, as soon as I got, like, everything put on, like, the balls on, I wanted to take them out and put the straight barbells back in. But my nipples were hurting. Like, it was very, very painful. So I obviously didn't want to do more damage to the piercing that day. So I waited until like I thought like it would be okay. So I probably waited mm, three weeks to a month before I did that. And honestly, putting the straight barbells back in hurt as bad as it did when I got my nipples pierced. Like it hurt so incredibly bad. I could not believe how bad it hurt. But I did it and after that, it just kind of, I could tell that I set the healing turn back because I like messed up the whole like, you know, tissue and all that kind of stuff. Um, so they are still healing right now. And that's 100% my fault. It has nothing to do 
with you know how my peers should pierce them like none of that like it just is honestly because I was stupid and I fucked up and I honestly should have known better so I just want to say um if you do want to change the jewelry from like straight barbell to curved or vice versa then just talk to your piercer about it they might be able to do it where it's like less painful I don't know you might have to wait till they're like 100% healed but just I would definitely talk to your piercer about it I did not because I just didn't think about it because I had a stupid moment um but this one is doing really really well um uh, it will still kind of be like slightly crusty because like I said they are still healing because I'm fucking stupid um but this one definitely tends to act up more this one won't hurt at all but this one will definitely like hurt just kind of randomly um you know and this one is having a harder time healing from the whole changing out the jewelry and all that kind of stuff um, but I mean really other than that they're doing great they are still healing I'm still cleaning them every day I'm taking care of them like it's you know like I just got them pierced um, but really other than I other than that I don't have much to report to you guys um, you know they're they're doing pretty well I think that if I hadn't tried to change them into the curved jewelry I could sit here and tell you that they were fully healed but because I messed up um, they're not fully healed but that's just you know something I'm dealing with and they're I mean but they're doing really well and you know they are healing fine and everything like that I I honestly think in like a month or two that they're going to be healed just fine um but like I said I really don't have much to report um I'm like I said I'm just taking care of them like they're a fresh piercing but I think that's it if you guys have any questions um just let me know down below and don't forget to check the description box down there because I have like, lots of playlists and they're all linked down there. I have a piercing playlist which just has, you know, um, all my piercing videos in it. So if you're curious about any of my piercings or if you want to check out my other nipple piercing videos, feel free to look in that playlist and you'll find them. So I think that's it. I love you all. Thank you so much for watching my video and hopefully you will check out my next one.